Good morning. Welcome to our last installment on the Gospel of Luke. 24 is the chapter, and we're looking at verses 50 to 53 today, and here they are. And he led them out as far as Bethany, and he lifted up his hands and blessed them. Now it came to pass, while he blessed them, that he was parted from them and carried up into heaven. And they worshipped him and returned to Jerusalem with great joy, and were continually in the temple, praising and blessing God. Amen. So there you have it, 24 chapters uh, in the Gospel of Luke, the actual literal Gospel of Luke. We've, we've looked at every verse all the way through and just had some thoughts as we went through. So Jesus now is going to depart. He goes with them as far as Bethany, and he blesses them, and then he's, he's sort of levitated. He's carried up into heaven and up out of their sight. It's an amazing sight, but it's a privilege they get to see Jesus going up into heaven. So he goes to the Father, and we talked about that yesterday morning, how the Holy Spirit will be poured out upon them. I want to look at their, finally, their attitude here then in this last segment. What did they do? They went with him. They worshiped him. They uh, returned to, to Jerusalem with great joy. I mean, they, they didn't hide it. They didn't come slinking in or sneaking into town. They came back joyful, and they were continually in the temple praising and blessing God. Boy, there must have been some, some Pharisees with glowering, uh, glowering brows there as all these Christians are there around the edges uh, giving praise to God. And, and, and they, these guys murder Jesus, and Jesus is alive and has just gone to heaven, and that's what they're talking about. You know, again, one last time, we serve a risen Savior, and he's in the world today. I hope you've enjoyed this, this uh, kind of fast flash through the Gospel of Luke. Remember what I said a few days ago? Yeah, you've maybe watched the videos, but you'll be even more blessed if you sit down with your Bible, with a physical Bible in your hand, turn the pages, to set aside three hours or so, read through the Gospel of Luke from front to back, read every line, think about it, pray about it as you go, and the Lord God will bless you and give you insights, way more insights than we might have had in these these uh, these 300 or so videos. Now, let me just say in, that uh, I'm glad you joined me for this, and I want to invite you as we start our next series, we're going to flip back now. We're going to go back to the Old Testament. We're going back to the prophet Zechariah. So I hope you'll join me in our very next devotional series. We're going to start in in Zechariah 1, verse 1. You can kind of look ahead and, and look ahead as we go through there and get the lay of the land. But we're going to study something from the Old Testament, including a lot of prophetic pieces. I think you'll be blessed. God bless you and keep you throughout this day.